Hello, hello, veggie fam. It is your girl, Ashley of Fervulous Veggies, coming to you with another Sunday recipe time. And this week, I had a craving. You know how Cheddar's had those like crescent rolls with the like butter and the honey on it? Well, I had a craving and I said, you know what? We about to remix that and make it veggie style. So, here are our crescents and the honey that we are gonna do. It's veggie style, because you know, sometimes people get a little iffy when it comes to honey, if it's vegan or not. So. I'm just gonna say veggie style. So stay tuned for my recipe for our remix of the Cheddar's Crescent Rose, honey. And you already know how I do. I do the overhead shots so you can see step by step for the recipe and then we wrap up the video at the end. So stay tuned. Okay, veggie fam. So we have the Crescents here. And obviously you just follow the instructions on there. You know how you have to press it with the spoon. Am I the only one who gets scared on this part? Like, ooh. Ooh, it just make you nervous. <laughs> oh no, I'm such a dork. I like, I don't like that. It just, ooh, it'd be shocking me. But anyway, so obviously here are your crescents. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna unfold it. And you got your little baking sheet. At this point in time, you need to have your oven at 350, okay? Have it at 350 so this can be ready. And I'm just gonna show how to roll like one of the little crescents and then we gonna make it look like ooh, cute at the end because you know it is eight of them out here but you kind of roll it like that and you put that on the little top make it cute and you sit it like that ain't that so cute ain't it cute okay so we are gonna do this and then like in two seconds you're about to see like the whole completed little plate and so it looks good before you put it in the oven and then of course we're gonna do the honey butter because that's what i got right here so stay tuned all right, so we have our cute little crescents. And what we're gonna do is, obviously I mentioned 350 in the oven. We're gonna do, it says nine to 12 minutes. So what I think we should do is 10 minutes and then do the honey butter on top, like right before it finishes, okay? So obviously you wanna monitor it, make sure it's not you know too golden honey. But yeah, so we're gonna put these in the oven and then the next is the honey butter. All right, veggie fam. So as you can see here, we have my melted vegan buttery spread. Um, it is honestly just a half a stick of it in there. And um, it's the buttery sticks that we always use. You know, I'm always using that same one, okay? I took it off the heat because honestly, when you add in the honey, it's just to warm the honey, okay? So we have half a cup of freshly like local honey. What is it like freshly gathered? <laughs> freshly sourced um but no the company i like to um support here is local in texas it's called good flow i use them all the time it is just such a good honey you know sometimes you just it has that that extra sweetness i don't know i like it it just tastes really good and floral and I don't know. I've just had it a few times and I just like it compared to some of the other ones. So I went ahead and we're just whisking it together because you just want the honey and the butter to get together and be happy. Okay. And then like always with all sweets, you should always put a little salt in it to just bring out the sweetness. Okay. Just, I don't know what it is with baking. It just does that. But I mean, look at how yummy this looks. Can you imagine us pouring this on top? This is about to be lit, okay? And that's it, literally. This is all you need for the honey butter sauce. It already look good. I know it tastes good, so I can't wait till halfway through. Put it on the uh, crescents that we have, and then, of course, we're going to finish it again with an extra layer, so it's about to be good. Check it out. Okay, so this is just at, like, 10 minutes, right? And then we're just going to go ahead and put that honey butter, ooh, 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 on top gonna be so good oh that look good pouring on there okay put that back in the oven for like what two more minutes these about to be so good i'm so excited i hope y'all are too <laughs> are y'all ready for the reveal are you ready okay let's let's show the reveal oh yes don't these look so good i can't wait to eat it that was a quick easy recipe and it looked like the ones that cheddar is on it I told y'all, I told y'all, yes. So, what do y'all think? Is that a recipe that you and your family can do? I think the kiddos would love it. It's quick, it's easy, and you don't have to worry about them being over like an oven or a stove, you know what I'm saying? Easy, right? So, let me know what you think. Comment below, share it, let your sister know how I did. 
Thank y'all so much for tuning in with me for another Sunday recipe time here at Fred Lewis Veggies, where we're always cooking up fresh dreams on a daily. Make sure to follow me on Instagram at Fred Lewis underscore veggies. And make sure to go ahead and check out my website, eatfredlewisveggies.com. Thank y'all so much. You have a good rest of your week.